Hello and welcome to another episode of Pathfinder. <laughs> I did some work off camera again. Uh, this is getting a little bit grindy now, but that's that's fine still. Um, yeah, it's still a little, you know, it's a little bit of mining. I still have some uncovered ores down there that I just didn't have the inventory room to get yet. So uh, so far, it's not that bad. Uh, and there also might be some ways to automate mining in this pack. I'm not sure yet, but yeah, I managed to get. Uh, full inventory again. Let's get rid of some stuff here. Um, so, what I needed to make uh, last time, at the end of last episode, was uh, the chat pack, the uh, redstone chat pack, and I have everything here. I think <laughs> I already arranged. So let's let's just let's just do this thing. Pretty sure I already forgot how the, how it went. Uh, okay, so what we'll be making here is the flux capacitor. It's three pieces of redstone, lead, copper, another piece of lead, and some sulfur. That's it, so it's really not that bad. The first part of the chat pack done. Very nice. The second thing we need for the chat pack is a redstone thruster. We need two of those, and those require um, some lead again, which is very easy to make. We've, done. <laughs> We've seen how to do that. Um, glass, which is also very obvious, we made a bunch of copper keys already. Uh, the rest of the reception coil is also very easy to make. What we haven't made before was uh, steam dynamos, which are a bunch of copper stuff, uh, a transmission coil and some redstone. And the uh, pneumatic servo, which is thankfully also really cheap. <laughs> so, yeah, let's put all of that together. Space and inventory even. Make the two thrusters that we need. I think that's the right way. Yes, let's do thruster. We have two of those. And everything else we need is some leather again and the leather strap, which is just four leather and two iron ingots. I have that already here. And now put it all together. And we get a jetpack. Never, <laughs> never had a jetpack in Minecraft before. So this holds twenty-five thousand uh, RF, and allows flight when active. Must be worn as a chest plate. Yeah, that's that's not an issue since we don't really need any armor whatsoever. Uh, how do we do this? We put it in here. Well, it charges quickly. I thought I might have to do something else while we wait for that, but. That was very quick. Uh, let me actually see. So there are there are upgrades. So this is a tier one uh, jetpack, and then there's. Uh, it seems to be the same, right? I don't know what what does the white background mean. Okay, iron armor plating. So that probably gives you some armor as well. Armored, yes, and this is armored. No, okay, that that doesn't really matter to us. So what do we need to harden our jetpack? We need hardened thrusters, hardened flux capacitors, and invar. So that's basically the same again, just with invar and tin instead of the uh, lead. And the thrusters are probably the same as well. Yeah, just everything upgraded once. <laughs> basically, yeah. So block of redstone. And uh, those reactant uh, dynamos use bronze. Yeah, okay. Instead of copper, yeah, just everything upgrade once. But I don't think. So the question is, how do I use this thing? I have never used one of these before. Okay. So how do I how do I not die using this thing? Like, uh, it says hover mode, but it's red, so it's probably off, right? So how do I turn it on? I have to check. <laughs> I should have done this before. Uh, clockwork, toggle, uh, energy utilities. I have no idea. It's map. 
Um, switch mode C. Doesn't work. Probably because there's a conflict with something else. Yeah, I mean, if I if I let go, it's just four. So <laughs> I really don't want to die here. I don't know what happens when I die. Oh, I assume I get back to the ship. But I don't. I'm not even sure if I have enough power on the ship to come back here. <laughs> ah, this is dangerous. Um, so what do we do? Let's try to change the key binding, I guess. What else is bound to see? Extra function right there. Do that. Put that on. I don't know. Okay, so now the simply chat backs. But is it is it a simply chat backs chat back? Who knows? Does it work now? Yes. Okay. Okay, now it takes me down slowly. Okay. So let's get up there. Okay, but it uses more power this way. But that's okay, I think. I think we can. While we go up, we can turn it off, right? It's pretty high. Oh, in the worst case, I can just jump into the water. So it should, it should be fine. Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> it uses quite a bit of power, but it, we're not going that far, so we should be fine. It's a pretty cool view from up here, which we don't have. A great mental distance here. Oh, there's a chest. With some <laughs> useless stuff. Okay. Uh, Rosebush times eight, some blue orchid, dandelion, sunflower, and some cobwebs. <sighs> Not what I was what I was hoping for. <laughs> I don't like, actually know what I was hoping for. It was just I don't know. Let's take the chest. Anything else here? Oh, the glowstone. We definitely need the glowstone. Um, we should take that, I think. Let's just check. No, okay, there's nothing. Uh, mossy stone brick. Actually, we might have a use for that. Let's check if we can make some. It's just some some way to get the moss off off of it to make some moss stone stuff. We can make a generator with that, we know that. Stairs. Is there a way to get. Oh, we can color stuff. Interesting. Yeah, I don't really care about that. Okay, we can make the ball of moss out of that. So we should we should take some of that for sure. To get the auto repair upgrade for for our next pickaxe. Um, are we good? Yeah, let's take all of it, why not? While we're up here. Or maybe not all, let's take enough for two. Ah, of course. <laughs> what don't I need? Uh, I don't need sticks, I guess. Well, I actually don't need the flowers, to be honest, but... <laughs> I kind of have to take them now, since I flew up all the way up here to get them. Seven, fourteen, fifteen. One more. Where is it? Why? Why can't I pick that up? That's so weird. I could pick it up. It just didn't work. It's a regular one. I don't need that. That's. Safe. 
Okay, that's weird though. Swimming with jetpack, very weird. Let's take it off. Ah, oh, I can't. I have, still have space. This is so weird. <laughs> it was a lot, of, a lot of fun too. Okay, why does it... Why does it... If it go down one block, it doesn't really need to hover for me. That's a bit unnecessary. But okay. Ah, let's put the close on it now. And ah, of course throw it on the ground, that's what I meant to do. Ah, let's charge it up again. Just in case we need it. Okay. Uh I won't be wearing that all the time for now, I think. It's a bit annoying. <laughs> but also a lot of fun. Uh so okay, we we have some more close on now, which I think I need it for something, but I don't remember what I wanted to do with that now. Yeah, can't think of it right now. We'll we'll figure it out once we get there, I guess. Uh oh, we have to complete the quest. Our quest completed, very nice. Um yeah, for more control flying. Okay, we get a reward back for that. Let's check that real quick. Dimlet of Terrain Islands. Okay. Do we have one of those before? No, it's a new one. Okay. That's good, I guess. I really need to work <laughs> on all of that stuff again. So we have our first, you know, quest chain thing completed. Better phone, whatever. <laughs> that is really hard. Um, okay. We also have Voyager pretty much completed. We, also, we only need to go back to our ship, I think. That's at least the way I understand this. Uh, we were thinking about making this thing last time. Framework. Let's do that. Why not? Or should I go back to the ship? Maybe make a new... But I, I still don't have... I don't know. <laughs> uh, framework was brass ingots. Five brass ingots, four iron. Uh, brass is copper and zinc, I think. Same, no, it's not right, it's different. Ah, uh, copper and sink. Some copper here, I think I have some sink lying around somewhere as well. What was that? Tin. Do I have some sink? Maybe I don't. I could have sworn I had some sink somewhere. Platinum, gold, nickel, some more copper, silver. Really, I don't have sink. Did I use it? Oh, there's my sink ore. I knew I had some. So can I make the the brass is three cup of one sink? Um, so in the alloy smelter, can I can I make can I make that in the alloy smelter? So then, alloys only. Burners only, alloys only. Let's see, is this an alloy I can make? Okay, I can't put the... Yeah, I need to crush that too, I assume. Pulverize it. I think, right? <laughs> I'm unsure now. Let's actually test that. Crush those two. Or was it three, three and one, right? Yeah, three and one. So.
Okay, it's not going out now because of that, maybe. What? I can't push back in? I thought I could. <laughs> I'm confused. Should have tried this before, I guess. Uh-huh. <laughs> Recipes. Well, there's a lot of them. <laughs> Do I need to... Like, choose the right recipe? I don't know. Copper and tin. And sink. Now I'm doing the right thing here. So, so much weird stuff here, and I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, get four of that. No, no idea if that's better, probably not. It's probably the same as mining it. It's a way for me to look at. The recipes in another way. I'm confused. I, I really am. <laughs> I thought I could just funnel two different um, types of dust in there to make the alloys, but apparently I can't do that. Whatever, okay. Can't do that. <laughs> what is aluminum brass? How do I make aluminum brass? Um, yeah, I know all of that. But how? How do I make that? I don't know, I'm confused now. <laughs> Seems like I'm missing something, maybe. I don't know. It's late and I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> it's basically what's going on here. If I turn it back to... ...or smelting... It smelts them again. It melts... Yeah, okay, whatever. This is confusing. Okay, let's let's skip that then. I'll, I'll look at that off-camera. See the how it works, try to figure it out. But there were some quests in here that we could do, or should we just go back to the ship? I really don't know what is the best way to, to do things in this, because I, I have all my machines set up here, I, I potentially could take them all with me, right? I could pick them up with my crescent hammer and just Take him, put them all in a bag, maybe? I don't know. Is it a good plan or not? I'm not sure. Let's actually look at the bags again. Can we upgrade this even further? Or is this as good as it gets? It's tier 2. Is there a tier 3? It doesn't look like there is. I don't know what canvas bags do. I mean, one of, one of, these, one of these would be really nice. Some wool, a bunch of gold, a chest and a diamond. Can actually make that, I think. Double chest worth of supplies in inventory space wherever you go. Yeah, I think we should we should try to make this. We need four pieces of wool, eleven gold, a chest and a diamond. I think I have shears somewhere, right? I do. Oh I also have wool, which is even better. <laughs> Uh, do I have enough gold? I do. Wow, this is... This is crazy. Let's put that away again. Uh, let's take a diamond. 
Uh, what else do I need? A chest. It's really cheap. Kind of. <laughs> oh, we have a... <laughs> a workbench right here. Uh, chest. War. Gourd. Diamond. Oh wow, that's a lot of space. <laughs> that is really good. Okay, so now we can, we could basically move all the machines um, back to the ship. Yeah, I think I think that's what we should do. Because right here, there's not a lot I can do now in this world. I could keep mining. I probably should take at least the cobalt and stuff that I found. Maybe make a really good pick and then move on from here. I mean, we can always come back, I assume. <laughs> uh, if you just put the, the the world, the dimension that we created away somewhere safe, or just remember how we how we how we built it, we should be able to come back here anytime. And uh, we could try to figure out some some new stuff. I mean, we have a lot of different limits here. We have a lot of interesting things that we could could make. We could make our very own world here. Some unknown limits as well. Actually, a bunch of them that we have to amplify. We could make an amplified world with I have no idea speed and. Okay, but it costs a lot of RF. So how do I maintain that then? I need to look into that book again. Because we can store quite a bit of energy here, but I don't think... I, I, if I put the generator in the ship, does it stay loaded? Oh, a lot of questions here. I'll have to look some stuff up, I think. And then uh, next episode, we'll probably head back to the Pathfinder with some fancy new gear. And we'll pack up all our stuff, put it in our golden bag of holding. We could even make a second one. With one diamond left. I think I have enough gold somewhere. I think I have in here. I have a bunch of gold still. That could be something. That could be something we should do. So. If you're ready to leave this world behind, then make sure to check out the next episode tomorrow, and uh, I will see you then. Bye-bye.